today guys we are doing another top three custom builds in gta online we're going to be upgrading some of the new dlc cars the ubermach reinhardt the vigero zx and the omnis egt three absolutely beautiful vehicles we're going to start off with the egt so let's hop on in it and head on over to the custom shop all right we have arrived let's see what we could do to this baby start off with armor and brakes make our way over to the front bumpers now this part, I don't really know what I want to do with it. I feel like I'm just going to make it the entire color. I feel like that looks pretty nice. But then again, adding that big ass splitter also looks okay. It's just, it's a little too big. I'm not going to lie. So for right now, let's go with just the primary bumper. For the diffuser, yeah, it's all the same stuff. Once again, we're just going to go with the OEM one. Just add a little color, upgrade the engine for a car that doesn't actually have an engine. Uh, do we want to add vents? I mean, you know what? that's honestly not too bad. Let's add some carbon vents on there. Now for this part right here, we could make that entire thing black like that. Maybe even just carbon, to be honest. That doesn't look bad at all. I actually kind of like the look of that. Uh, definitely not that though. Uh, let's see, xenon lights for sure. For the vinyls, let's see. I mean, I kind of like the look of that, but it just looks a bit weird. The full black stripes are pretty clean. We're going to toss that on for the time being. For the roof, uh, we could put the arrow box on. Hmm, I'd probably want to go with this one if I were to put it on. No, winged skirts and canners, no. Um, can we just, we can just get the skirts, right? Yeah, we're just going to go with carbon skirts on there. For the spoiler, we definitely don't need something that big. I mean, we could just go with a simple roof spoiler there. That's not too shabby. Everything else is literally a wing, which I don't really want to put on. We're just going to go with the roof spoiler. We, uh, do we want, let's see, it does add a little camber there. I feel like we're just going to go with street or sport. I think street sport seems a bit too low for the wheels. Let me see how wild wagon looks on here. It, that's not terrible. Concave racer is actually kind of clean on it. That's not terrible either. That's pretty nice. Let's leave that on for right now. And limbo window tint. There we go. Okay. Now for the color for the color, we got pure black, which I'm not going to lie. looks badass. This looks badass. I love this look. Sheesh. Okay, wait, let me see how that looks, though, with comp suspension. I mean, that's dropped to the floor with the with these rims as well. That looks nice. Let's go with sports suspension instead, actually. So I don't want it dropped to the floor. For the secondary color, what is this change? The mirrors. Uh, I say, honestly, we'll go with matte black for that. Now, for the vinyl, we could toss some white stripes on there. That looks pretty cool. Wow. Wow. Okay. I mean, some of these are decent. Oh, well, I love that. Well, that is perfect. That is literally perfect. It adds nothing. Just take a look at this, right? This is what we're actually putting up. Oh, that's so sexy. Oh my God, bro. This is such a nice car. You can make this matte black. You can't even see the geometric on it. Like it's so light. Like you could see it a tiny bit. You could barely see it. The main thing you see is the stickers on the side skirt there. And let me go to the grays. Like, look at this guys. Wow, that is beautiful. If you're going to copy this build, definitely go with the geometric vinyl and then put it in a matte light gray or gray. I mean, these colors are all, I mean, they look okay. It's just not my style. I, I think this though, this looks menacing. This also looks clean, but like this, this looks real nice. But then again, pure black, keeping it basic and simple. And then all you have are the stickers on the skirt right there. That looks really clean, but End of the day, I think we're going with a gray. I think we're going with the gray on there. Man, oh man, this thing is sexy. Wow. No, I'm loving this look. I am loving this look. Too bad it's raining now. Like, I mean, in this weather, it's kind of hard to see it. But like, I mean, it still looks beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Yes, sir. I'm liking it. I'm really liking it. It still looks practically bone stock, except for the aero box on the roof. If we just had a couple more options for splitters and diffusers, I feel like the car would be perfect. I might even change that to a light matte gray because it's really, really hard to see the vinyl on there. So we might change that in a minute. Let's take the Vigero ZX to the custom shop. I've upgraded this car once before and I made Bumblebee. I like that look. It looked nice, but I don't think we're going with Bumblebee today. I don't think we are. We're gonna, we're gonna try something else out. All right, we have arrived at the custom shop. Let's see what we could do to this baby. Repair it first for only 152 bucks. We're definitely, first thing that we're gonna do is actually just drop the suspension because I cannot stand that gap. Look at the freaking gap between the wheels. We got lots of upgrades here. So uh, let's start off with the basic stuff. Make our way to the front bumpers. Oh man, I like that actually. I really like that. I, oh, I say we go with 
carbon or maybe the trim fin what is this like is that just the secondary color yes it is okay so whatever we make the secondary color it'll show on there okay i'm down with that i'm down with that rear bumper we want to do a somewhat similar design something like that i'm down with that yeah i'm good i'm good for that i'm good for that engine upgrade that exhausts uh, uh ooh, hexagon looks cool and I'm pretty sure we can actually change the color of those, if I'm not mistaken. Can we? We can't. Oh, I think I have to go with that. I don't. Have we ever been able to do that? Like change the color of the exhausts? I, that looks really cool. I like that. Might change it though. I don't know if I want the exhaust to be the same color as the uh, diffuser. Grill. Oh, I love this upgrade, guys. I wish we could do this on more cars because Rockstar tends to put the same styling of a grill, like the material used, I guess, on a lot of different cars. And this is one of the only cars where we can actually change it or at least add something sick as hell to it like this. Amazing. We're definitely not going to be doing a secondary color. We're going to be going black for sure. And I think it's going to be the GT grill. I love the look of that hood. But let's see what else they got. Even this one just removes a couple vents. That one's not bad. That's not bad. Even this simple, clean hood. Not bad either. And then we got these. I think we're going to stick with this one for now. For the lights, Xenon headlights. For the vinyl, let's see what we could do to it, actually. Let's see, is there anything special? It's just stripes here. Nothing crazy. Anything with black on it? Not really. Mm, I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. I can't put that on. No. Okay, uh, where were we? Where were we here? Uh, louvers. We are going to put louvers on. I love the look of louvers. I think we're just going to keep it simple. Carbon street louvers right there. I mean, you could go crazy and put this one on, but I, that just looks ugly as shit. I would never put... Same with this. No. I mean, these ones are nice. These ones are actually really nice. We might... Actually, I'm going to go with these. Yeah. I like those more. Uh, for the mirrors, uh, we're... Uh, yeah, we're going to have to go with the GTs. Definitely GT. Not carbon, though. Just regular. Okay. Color. We'll do that after. Roof. We're leaving the roof alone. Skirts. Uh, nothing too crazy, but I would like to do the trim one. Yeah. Trim performance skirt right there. Beautiful. Spoiler. Even these are nice, just basic, very basic. We could go with a wing, could go with a small wing on the back of it. Let's toss the commando spoiler on for now. Sun strip, let's go with a primary one. I like Super Lux and i5, mainly because I don't have the other ones unlocked. Deep flakes are good. Even Wild Wagon. Wild Wagon's actually not too bad on this car. I'm gonna toss that on for right now. Kinda like that, kinda like that. Uh, enhancements, there we go. Wind. okay perfect okay now let's think of the color i might change those wheels up though we'll have to see orange purple flit no no that's too much this is clean this is clean damn these chameleon colors are nice the gold is no i might just stick with gray though and pearlescent wise i mean i don't think i'm gonna even put one on just, just black uh we're gonna have to change the secondary color then from a chameleon color to uh i don't know maybe even a white no no, I, I'd, I'd say we just have to do black then. Okay, wheels. What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing for the wheels? Okay, you know what? We're just going to pick one and go with it. I might change them. I might change the wheels. We went with high-end carbon solar rims, which I haven't put on my cars in forever. I just need to see how this looks out here. Uh, I'm heading right back into the custom shop. And I'm also taking the wing off. Yeah, we're going for more of a simplistic build, I think. We are going to go with the aftermarket spoiler. Maybe carbon. Yeah, let's let's keep it carbon. Screw it. I'm going concave mega mesh. I'm going concave mega mesh. It's just because, like, certain cars, I don't want to see the rotors as much. And with mega mesh, it kind of hides them a lot more, which is pretty much the only reason I'm popping it on. There we go. Nice, simple build. Keeping it simple. I would have liked to do Bumblebee. I'm not going to lie. Whenever I, whenever I want to drive this car... This is one of the only cars I would actually enjoy driving with a bright yellow on it. We got a dark-ass gray Omnis EGT. We got a black steel Vigero ZX. I am not going... Oh, maybe I will. I might do all the cars gray. Ooh, that would look nice. Then I'm going to have to change the color of the, the Omnis there. Hmm, I'm debating it. I'm debating it. We'll see. We will see. We will see. What is happening with GTA? What is going on? Hello, Mr. Okay, there we go. Shit is weird. Armor, brakes, bumpers. Let's see. Ooh. Okay, it's simple. Simple. That's simple. Beautiful right there. Let's scroll through. Don't like any of those. Yeah, we're good. Okay, diffuser. Nope. Yes, for now. Nah. Nah, we're going with that one. Yeah, we're going with the one we got on. Seats. Uh, do we want to make it like a race car? Why not? Let's do it. Engine. Exhausts. 
No, God, no. Uh, I'm thinking this one looks nice. I'm going to go with that for now. And then it's all sides. Yeah, I'm good with what I got there, I think. Uh, for this, I mean, I, I would like to be able to show both. I'd like to be able to show the intercooler and then also have a cool grill slats or something. But I guess not. So we're just going to be going with grill slats. Uh, for the hood, let's see. That's too much. That's too much. That's too much. That's okay. That's good for now as well, actually. I mean, this isn't... No, oh, no, that's way too much. No, that's... That's way too much. That one's okay. That one's enough. That is definitely enough. No. Oh, Rockstar. No, Rockstar. No. What are these, man? Bro. No. Oh, this is ugly. Oh, they're all so bad. They are all so incredibly bad. Wow. That was just dreadful. We're gonna go with a black steel for now. Take off the pearlescent. Secondary color changes nothing once again. Uh, can we put an arrow box on here as well? We can. Wow. Uh, surfboard. I kind of want to put the arrow box on. I kind of want to. Just to see. You know what? Let's, let's just see. Uh, let's just go with carbon race skirts. Spoiler. No. Oh, God. Oh, oh who in their right mind would put that? That giant ass wing on this car. That is just not it. The most you should do for this car ever would be this, the large boot lip. Or maybe even this if it's an actual race car, but like, still, I mean, I'm probably just gonna go, I mean, I think we're gonna go with this, just a little boot lip, just like that. That's more than enough. Sunstrip, oh wow, they got a couple. They got a couple available. Let's go with primary for now. Suspension, does it add a camber? No, it does not. Let's go with sport suspension, race transmission, turbo tuning, wheels. Uh, we're gonna go, I think I'm gonna go deep flakes on these. I'm going deep flake on this car. Yeah, I don't know. It just looks so ugly. Okay, now let's look at vinyls. Let's see what we got here. I mean, they just don't look good, but I want to put one on. This one's actually not bad. This one, I mean, let me try something. Oh, I wish I had a pure white crew color right now. See, like, you can make it pure white and then just add stickers. This still doesn't look that bad, though. Even this isn't bad. I think if we do it, we're gonna have to go white, but then, like, it just, it still looks ugly. <laughs> oh, man. Freaking Rockstar. Like, see this. Oh, that would be perfect. Oh, with a pure white finish. Basic. Very basic, but it looks clean. Oh, that would be so perfect. It's like it deserves to have a pure white finish with just, like, the basic lettering on it. Oh, man. Oh... I would definitely go with that. That would look so clean. And then these are just ugly and basic. It doesn't even go over the freaking arrow box. It goes right through it. What am I going to do with Rockstar Games? Oh my goodness. I think we're going to have to go with this. Because I don't want to leave it alone. Like, I don't want it to look like this. It looks too basic. And it's just, it looks weird. I'm not going to lie. It just looks really weird the way it's sitting. It needs something like this or like this and then if i do end up putting that on i'm honestly good to put like something like that on it as well making it into a full-blown race car they really made some ugly ass liveries for this car like they just don't look good and then the car itself it just doesn't look good either oh huh. let's go with that let's let's go with that i can't like this is the best i could do for this car i i really can't find a just stunning look for it it's so hard to do like i mean I, I don't even know what wheels to throw on it's difficult with this thing it's not an easy car to upgrade unlike a lot of other cars where it just naturally looks good like this one you gotta be like i don't know let's go with the slugoy concaves let's just go outside let me just see this oh god like this no okay yeah so we're, we're making a clean build we're switching it up yeah i'm not doing that no this car is just not it this is not a nice car when it's upgraded it's just it's just not good we're taking the roof box off we are gonna go with a straight vortex generator taking the spoiler off we're gonna go with the boot lip and then we're gonna take the vinyl off freaking put a stripe down the middle there we go i mean it still doesn't look good i just have to say the car itself doesn't look good it looks ugly it's not a nice car let's go back to the garage let's take a look at the cars see what we got so far it is fast though bro this shit's quick as hell now holy crap Fully upgraded, she's actually going fast. Not the worst handling until a pedestrian decides to just switch lanes at the last second. All right, we got the three cars. Let's take a look at these things. Okay, Reinhardt, Vigero ZX, and the Omnis EGT. Not bad. I am going to change the color on this, though. All right, let's toss like a light gray or a metallic dark or black steel. Yep, black steel right now. Done. Pearlescent, changing it to black. Done, done, done. Beautiful. 
This is definitely the nicest looking car out of the three with the customizations I put on them. This thing looks sick. And there we go. Let's close the door, please. Can we can we close the door, please? No, I'm just gonna hop back in it and hop back out. There we go. Thank you. All right, Omni C GT, Vigero ZX, Uber Mach Reinhardt. I wish there were better vinyls for this car. It just, I wish the car looked better in general. Wow, that dude was mugged for $10. Honestly, I'm actually kind of liking it. I'm kind of liking it. Def this car is definitely the nicest in terms of customization. This one, obviously, the Vigero ZX is a beautiful car. It looks okay in gray. It's not the worst thing in the world, but it's definitely not my favorite look. And the Reinhardt, I mean, you know what? I think it actually looks okay in gray. Very simple build. Uh, nothing too special about it. Anyways, guys. That's pretty much it. Let me know what you think of these builds down below in the comment section. Obviously, I could have gone for other colors, but I decided to do just a full gray build for all of the cars. So let me know what you think of it down below. But anyways, thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. With that said, I will catch you guys in the next one.